This is Power Jams, the wake-up show. I'm on the phone lines with Tammy Cameron. She's with Tammy Cameron Real Estate, and her phone number is 818-930-3993. Welcome to our community, Tammy. Hi, how are you? Bless, sis, and highly favored. How are you? I'm doing good. Hey, Tammy, God bless you, girl. We're going to break our fast in a minute up in here. (laughs) About to get our eat on. Tell us a little bit about yourself. I know you sell houses and all that, but what else you be doing? Um... I'm kind of a homebody when I'm not working just because, um, you know, I work so much and my husband works a lot. So, you know, a good time would be to relax and maybe watch a movie or spend time with the family. That's that's what I like to do. Hey, me. That's what's up. I'm on the phone lines with Tammy Cameron of Tammy Cameron Real Estate. COVID got you on lockdown, Tammy. <laughs> Jose. Not only because of COVID, but just because when I'm, when I'm able to relax, um, you know, that's, that's very rare. You kind of have to live your life like a firefighter. You you at home, but you always ready. Right. <laughs> Did COVID kind of change your workflow? And, you know, do you do anything different? Well, um, we are considered essential. So um, there was a time where it slowed down a little bit in, I think that was in April. Around April, it kind of slowed down. Um, but then right after that, it got crazy, crazy busy. But we have um, had some guidelines that we have to follow. And, of course, wearing your mask, um, wearing uh, sometimes wearing the little booties that go over your feet when you go into Booty. people's house. Um, and then, of course, hand <laughs> sanitizer. On, no more open houses. Um, and everything has to be by appointment only. Okay. So we have to make sure that. Uh, we don't have too many people in one house at at any given time. Right. And so some some even like some sellers will have restrictions where um, there can only be two people in a house at a time. So um, there has been some changes, but we're still kind of moving along. Thank God. Tell us about Tammy Cameron Real Estate. OK, well, first of all, I'd like to say um, I've been doing this for 20 years and um, I really feel like um, my strong base of loyal repeat customers is the reason why um, I am successful and have been in the business for so long because it is a very competitive uh, sales environment. Um, But what I do is I'm a full service uh, realtor and um, basically I represent my buyers and sellers from end to end from the start of the transaction to the end of the transaction. And what I do is I negotiate all the real estate contracts for both buyers and sellers, and um, I facilitate the entire escrow process, which means I schedule all the inspections, I negotiate the repairs, negotiate the prices, of course, I also assist with uh, getting them financing, and I just really make sure that my clients are covered through the entire process and try to make it as smooth as possible. I enjoyed the time when I bought my hair. Yeah, I, I enjoyed the shopping process as well for myself, but I'm thinking about the listening audience. It could be scary though, right? It's a time where when you're buying a house or you're buying investment property or you're selling a house, you can be very, you know, stressed out, um, a little bit worried, especially the the first time buyers that's never done this. So I try to make it as smooth as possible and as easy as possible for all of my clients. This is Power Jams, the wake up show. I'm on the phone lines with Tammy Cameron. She's with Tammy Cameron Real Estate and her phone number is 818-930-3993. I encourage all first time buyers. Matter of fact, anybody, if you hear my voice and you have questions about home ownership or even selling a home, give Tammy a call. Once again, the number is 818-930-3993. And I love how your business card reads. I mean, I like um, how you got that key in the middle of the T and the C. Yeah, but the most important part that I like is where it reads the greatest compliment you could ever give me is a referral to your friends and family. My vision is to build lifelong relationships one person at a time, starting with you. I like that. I like how you have that on your business card. Talk to us about it. Well, I think in, in, in life, getting a referral for anything you need is always the best because it's coming from someone that has actually utilized, um, utilized the service that you're looking for. So when someone refers, you know that more than likely um, this person that you're about to use is going to be great because someone that you know, a friend, a family has utilized them and can attest to to that exactly. And so I think 
being a realtor, um, a huge part of my business is uh, referral based. And um, I mean, when I say huge, I mean huge. And I really pride myself on that. And that is why I take care of my clients because of large part of my business is repeat business. And so I want to make sure that I take care of them, that in the end, they're happy so that they can refer me, uh, their friends and family. And um, that's why I do a great job. At, and that's why I do what I do. Yeah. Back in the day, I used to sell automobiles and we used to have to do code calling. And it's just nice to know that you value relationships and referrals. It's an important part to your success. Yeah, I mean, people want someone they know they can rely on, someone that they know they can trust, especially when it comes to buying a house. You're dealing with people's, you know, personal information, and you really want someone you can rely on and know that your their information is safe with you, and you don't have to always do the cold calling and, and you know, that kind of thing when you have repeat uh customers coming in and um, it really pays off and it really it just makes me feel good to do a great job for people and and have them let everyone know and that's what we want to do on this broadcast let everybody know about Tammy Cameron real estate do you have a Facebook page Tammy I do have a Facebook page it's Tammy Cameron real estate at Tammy Cameron sells homes Tammy for our listeners out there that are looking uh, to buy a house or maybe have a vision of buying a house What's the first couple of steps they should take in uh, that process? Well, before we get into that, I would say inflation has made it has made paying rent not make sense anymore for the most part, because uh, rent is is so high now, not like it was 21 years ago, but rent is so high now that it's almost and the rates are so low right now that it's almost the same when you compare your rent and your mortgage, that it just really it is a no brainer that you want to uh, stop paying rent, pay yourself and, you know, get into a home. Um, because now that you've said you bought 21, 22 years ago, um, now that you've gotten this far, you have a lot of equity. So with that equity, you can use that to retire you can use that to buy a business. You can use that to fix up your home. I mean, there's so many things you can do. Had you still been paying rent, you wouldn't have that two hundred, three hundred thousand dollar uh, cushion that you have right now. And I think sometimes people need to think about that. They need to think about their future and they need to think about their financial future because, as you know, one day you're 20, but the next day, you know, you're 50, you're 60. And it goes by, it goes by so extremely fast before you know it. And you want to be able to look back and have something to show for that. And paying someone else's mortgage um, is not the way to go. And um, you, if, if you're paying your rent every day, you can pay a mortgage every day. You just need to budget for it. And the first place to start is to get pre-qualified. Uh, talk to a lender, which is is where I come in and I help facilitate that. But talking to a lender, seeing if you qualify, if you do, great. But if you don't, they will tell you what you need to do to get there so that you can start working on it. And um, with the rates being so low, a lot of people are will be surprised that they can qualify. What's needed to pre-qualify for a home? So there's basic qualifications that you have to have in order to to qualify. Okay. And then from there, um, after you pre-qualify, then um, there's a little bit more research done um, into your your personal financial background. But to pre-qualify, the basic minimum things that you need to have are obviously um, income, a job, money coming in. And and to show proof of that, you're going to need two years tax returns. Two years tax returns that show, uh, you know, in the last two years what your income has been. You're also going to need, obviously, to have um, a bank account because they do ask for uh, two to three months of bank statements. And then um, they do run your credit. Okay, and those are the basic things that they will do to get your pre-qualified. Not, not, not hard stuff. Most of most people have those items in life. Most people have that, and um, they're basically looking at that to see what your overall debt is, what your overall income is, and then they're going to let you know, uh, based on those items, uh, what they think you can afford. 
and then we take it from there. This is Power Jams, the Wake Up Show. Special guest Tammy Cameron's on the phone lines. And this is the part of the broadcast we simply call Minister Rogers Neighborhood. And I'll be back right after a few words. Hey, my name is George, and I love the Chick-fil-A grilled nuggets. It's like me grilling at home. It tastes very similar to that, except the seasoning. I I probably can't season it as well as uh, Chick-fil-A does. The chicken's super tender, and honestly, the best nuggets I've ever tasted. My name is Meredith, and a little thing I love about Chick-fil-A's mac and cheese is the oven-toasted cheesy top layer. If home had a flavor, it would be Chick-fil-A's mac and cheese. I'm passionate about it. (laughs) Hi, this is Reggie Rogers from the national syndicated radio program, Power Jams, The Wake Up Show. Let us help you take your business to the next level. With over 35 years of radio broadcasting and entertainment experience, let us go to work for you. 661-319-6345. That's 661-319-6345. Or go online to powerjams.org. That's P O W E R. J-A-M-Z dot O-R-G. My name is Dexter. Two days in a row while I was using, I heard a Teen Challenge story on the radio. And I knew I should look into this. No matter what lies you've bought, there is hope. If you know an adult or teenager who's struggling with a chemical addiction, Teen Challenge can help. Call us today at 417-581-2181 or reach us online at teenchallengeusa.com. Power Jam's The Wake Up Show is sponsored in part by New York Life. Know what makes retirement less scary? Getting a check every month. With an income annuity from New York Life, you pay some money up front and then get checks for the rest of your life. One, two, three, four, five checks. Be good at life. New York Life. Call John Border at New York Life, 661-325-8113. That's 661 area code 325-8113. If we're going to say no to lupus, we need to know lupus. Lupus almost took my life. No. 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 No lupus. No lupus. Because there is something we can do. Each of us. All of us. There is hope. We just have to get involved. I haven't given up. I challenge you to know lupus. Go to lupus.org slash no. There is hope. Powerjams.org. P-O-W-E-R-J-A-M-Z dot org. If you would like to support this radio ministry, make your donation to Power Jams P.O. Box 78204, Bakersfield, California, 93383. Thank you, and may God continue to bless you and yours. Welcome back to Power Jams, the wake-up show, Minister Rogers' Neighborhood. I'm on the phone lines with Tammy Cameron of Tammy Cameron Real Estate. Phone number is 818-930-3993. Once again, 818-930-3993. Tammy, what is the best place to buy a house? I mean, what's hot right now? What's popping when it comes to folks, you know, kind of, you know, getting the best deals on homes? Just from experience, a lot of my clients are moving out of Los Angeles. Well, I can't say Los Angeles. They're moving out of uh, the Valley area. Uh, West LA, and they're relocating to um, the Antelope Valley, Bakersfield, just because it's just a lot more affordable and you get obviously a bigger house for less money. And I'm seeing that a lot. And, and um, you know, I don't blame them. It is, it is pretty expensive in, um, you know, the Valley areas. Um, and that's why people are making that move. So I would say uh, Lancaster, Palmdale, Antelope Valley, um, and then uh, obviously Bakersfield is always a good area. Nice Bakersfield is is very safe um, from my experience. Very quiet, kind of a chill area, and um, a lot of people are making that move. So that's exciting. Yeah, and also what's exciting is you're mobile. I mean, you don't have to just stay in the uh, L.A. County area. I mean, you out and about, right? All over the place in Southern California. I work. Los Angeles, the Antelope Valley, Kern County, Riverside County, Ventura County, Santa Barbara um, County as well. So I'm I'm all over and um, and I don't mind. That's Tammy Cameron of Tammy Cameron Real Estate. And 
we're taking the sting out of buying a home. Uh, we're trying to educate you, inform you. Uh, a lot of folks think, you know, it, it it's so hard to buy a house. It's really not hard. You're paying your rent every every month. You're going to pay your mortgage. You know, that's the first thing that we pay is 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 where we live. And there's a lot of programs out there for um, first time buyers um, that actually can help you with your down payment, their down payment assistance programs. Of course, um, there are parameters you have to qualify. You have to have a certain amount of income or not too much income. Um, but it's it's not that hard to buy a house. It's actually fairly easy. And uh, with my help, I guide you the entire way. And before we even get started, I tell you, you know, what it takes what the upfront costs are going to be, how everything works, so that my clients feel very comfortable about moving forward. But I think a lot of people always think, oh, buying a house, it's a huge commitment. Um, it's hard to do, um, but it's, it's really not. Um, if you have a job, you, you're paying rent, um, you're going to do the same thing. You're going to pay your mortgage every month. It's not that hard. And so I would like to stress that right now, it's a great time to buy. It's a kind of a weird market because it's a buyer's market and it's a seller's market. I would say it's a buyer's market because rates are historically low right now. I think the only way for them to go is up. So right now we know what it is and it's, it's a good time to buy. It's also a great time to sell because prices are up. It, it, it is also considered a seller's market. So, um, you know, I would just like to stress that if you're thinking about buying a house or it's been a thought and you think you can't do it, give me a call and let's go over this before you make up your mind because more people can buy than they think. Excuse me, Brother Rogers. Tell me, what's the important thing we should know about selling a house? Uh, when selling a house, it's a little bit different um, because there's no like pre-qualifications as far as selling a house. But I think um, the most important thing would be to give me a call because before you can decide to sell your house, you want to know, you know, what is it going to sell for versus what I owe on it? And then how much am I going to be left with? And you know, of course I help with that to help them understand what uh, once they sell it, what, what their profits are going to be. And that's really the deciding factor unless, you know, someone has to move their, their uh, changing jobs or, or they just need to get out of the house for financial reasons. But usually you want to make sure that um, you check and see what, uh, your property is going to sell for, and you would give me a call to do that, and I would uh, prepare a market evaluation for you, and um, and make sure you understand, you know, what the current market conditions are, and and what you're going to make from your home selling. Tammy, the last time I was walking uh, neighborhoods and you know looking at different homes that were on the market, uh, I noticed the sign, but then sometimes you notice that box that's on the door, and in that box it has a uh, paperwork and flyers, things of that nature. Help us out. Uh, can we deal directly with you or do we have to call the numbers and the information that's on that flyer? Do we have to deal with those real estate agents directly? What a great point, Reggie. I'm glad you brought that up because I wasn't even thinking about that, but great point. I have the key to get into any house that you see within Southern California um, online. So all I need is the address, and I can look it up for you, um, make the phone calls, do the research, let you know um, you know, what the price is and um, if there's offers on it, what's going on with the property and why they're selling. Um, so no, you don't have to, you as a buyer or a seller have the right to use any anyone that you want to use. And so um, that's pretty much it. You can use whoever you want. And so all I would need is the address. Hey, Amen. That's what's up. Yeah, that's it right there. I love it because you can find a phone number no matter where you're at in California. You get a phone number. Give it an address. Uh, all you got to do is call Tammy at 818-930-3993. She can do the research for you, get you some information. And, uh, hey, you've taken the first couple of steps to purchasing a home. Hi! Tammy also has a website. It's searchinglancasterhomes.com. Tammy, I want to thank you so very much for being on the broadcast. Thank you so much. And I'd just like to add that um, with all my clients, I promise to provide an unparalleled level of service and professionalism to every client. And really for me, success uh, starts with uh, my commitment to my clients. And that goes way beyond the sale. 
And I really feel like I'm successful when I'm able to develop lifelong relationships built on trust with all of my clients. And Reggie, I thank you so much for having me today. Um, really appreciate you and um i love your radio show hey thanks sis thank you tabby god bless you keep up the good work sis have a great day all right you too talk to you soon